Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to my channel. Welcome to all soccer manager best tactics. And yes, today you will see one of the best tactics in my channel. Yes, I recommend you to see this tactic because it's really amazing and will help you a lot. Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to my channel. Welcome to Online Soccer Manager Best Tactics. And yes, today I will show you one of the best tactics that I made. And yes, we are talking about 631 against stronger opponents than you. That's fantastic. You know that in my channel we have also 5311. I recommend you a lot. And now we have with 631. Fantastic tactic. But I want to remember you guys that this tactic is made only against stronger opponents than you. Now I will explain a little bit how is working that, uh, how to see which opponent is stronger than you and which one is not. Because if you use this tactic against one opponent that you have chances to win him, will not work or you will have less results than you expect and of course guys before we start this video don't forget to support the channel with your big like to subscribe and also to comment what do you think about this time okay guys so now i will explain a little bit uh, how it's working with the stronger opponents how to see which one is stronger which one is not stronger when to use this tactic when to don't use it so stronger opponent doesn't mean that for example you are playing against manchester city manchester united i am with norwich that his objective is to be 16 to save his life in the premier league basically uh, if i face for example manchester city liverpool manchester united that they are great teams doesn't mean that for example if they have more squad value they are much better than me no of course because maybe they don't have balanced team uh, they don't know how to control the team depends on the managers as well so you don't have to see about that it's one of the things that you have to see yes the squad value is important but another thing that you have to see is the league table if they are going well on the league if they are good on the league if they are winning matches if they are on the top it's fine will be a difficult match and also if they have more squad value than you of course i mean to have big difference between the your squad value and his squad value to have a big difference not we are not talking about 20 millions 50 millions we are talking about 80 100 millions that it's a different squad value of course so yes if they are playing really well the manager is good and also they have biggest uh, big squad value of course will be a stronger opponent if it's not like that it's not a stronger opponent so you don't have to use this time okay the lineup that we will use guys will be 631a i was trying with 631b as well but it's not the same maybe we will do one tactic for 631b because it should be different so for the moment we will use this lineup 631 and i think it's really easy to use because you should have all these players in your team even if you use 43 442 b all these kind of um, positions it will be really easy for you because you have really good position also to find them in the market so yes you will have to use one striker one central attacking midfield two central midfields one central back and yeah basically four central backs one left back one right back and also the goalkeeper really important guys like always i said try to put players in his right position help you a lot why because you are playing against a stronger opponent so you have to do the things as perfect as possible guys really so always try to have all the players in his right position like you can see over here another thing that i recommend of course is to try to have a balanced team yes or yes in this case we can say that we have a balanced team but only we have like two players that is the central attacking midfield and the central back that we have over here 
that they have different level respect the, the team but it's okay we are at the start of the season we can do that we can uh, make a transfer or something like that but if not always guys try to keep him like that to try to have all the players in his right position super important another thing that i recommend you guys is the bench the bench is really important especially for the first option of every position first option is really important in this case remember that here we have one striker that is Puki. okay try to have in the forwards for the first option in the bench one striker don't put one left back one uh, right forward or something like that to do it for example like that to put Rashika here because he will be the first one and he will go here so it's not a good option guys uh, try always to put the right option in the bench uh, as well for the midfields for the defenders uh, midfields central midfields I have two of them central attacking midfield I don't have and for example for defenders these are the best two that i have because the rest are they have like 63 58 of overall is too low so i will use williams and uh, biram for left back and right back let's go now with the specialist that also it's a really important part of the game captain of course always i recommend you the most oldest player in your team uh, the most veteran player in this case we have cruel with 33 years old i was thinking that he's 36 37 but he's only 33 it's okay penalties the only striker that we have it's pookie so pookie will be the man for the penalties for the free kicks and corner the best central midfield or central attacking midfield that you have in this case the best one with the higher overall we have uh, gilmour so we will use for the free kicks and for the corner let's go now with the tactics and i will explain you little by little uh, why i choose these tactics and why it's super important for this lineup 631 first of the things we will play long ball really important so yes you have six defenders the only option against one stronger opponent long ball that's it long ball to the pookie that is the striker and he's trying to score goals that's it really easy the line tactics the striker the forwards he will only attack is the only one so i will not ask him to go to defend or something like that he will have to stay only there try to score goals and that's it the midfields they will have to protect the defense to help on the defense so yes and the defenders of course guys to defend deep zonal marking yes or yes uh, you cannot choose personal marking man marking against one stronger opponent because they are much better than you so it's much better zonal marking will go like two or three players in one if it's any case and that's it offside of course not don't play with that when you are against one stronger opponent uh, tackling here you know that always i recommend you for the tactics guys to use how you want depends of the referee but remember that you are playing against one stronger opponent so of course i recommend you aggressive or i recommend you reckless even reckless guys yes you have to do it like that if you want to win the match if you want to uh, take one point at least reckless reckless guys i recommend you only when the referee is green or blue that's it when it's orange or red of course i recommend you guys aggressive so that's it because you are playing against one stronger opponent you will need to be like that if you want to get one point at least and let's go with the numbers pressing we will see deep uh, 30 that's it the style part the bus we will have to part the bus uh, long passing and try to score goals that's it and the tempo of course high speed passing 77 long pass fast passing that's it we cannot play for example to play with position no because they are much better than us we cannot play tiki taka we have to pass the ball really fast and that's it try to score goals and yes guys these are the tactics for 631 lineup i will show you now some results about how it's going what is doing the tactic but first of the things i want to remember you guys that if you use this tactic it uh, doesn't say that you will win the match yes or yes no you will not win the match yes or yes because you are using this tactic because you are following all the steps no you are doing the things so you have to do it and depends of the luck and depends also about many things in the game so yes will be sometimes when you will lose one new two new is happening like that or normally with this tactic it's just made to try to compete this opponent so we will try to compete we will try to win of course and but basically we will try to compete to get at least one point to draw or to win those are the things
Okay, let's see now some results. You can see against Aston Villa that uh, it's a much better opponent than us. Not too much, but yes, it's a biggest opponent than us. You can see two new and also 10 shots. It's okay. My long ball, our passing, our style is fine. And the opponent only three shots. That's it. The possession is not important, guys, because the possession, we don't need the possession now. We don't need uh, in our stay, in our style the, the possession. We only try to do like that. Win. At least two new and that's it game against arsenal guys arsenal first important match arsenal of course it's uh, a biggest opponent much better than us for the moment in the start of the season after if you do transfer this kind of things you will not be anymore the the basic team you will have more transfer you will be much better so of course you don't need to use uh, this tactic anymore so you can see that against arsenal 1-1 one, one, and basically is the tactic what is doing he was trying to win, minute 88, we score one goal, we compete against Arsenal and really good match, we get one point. Against Chelsea guys you can see 2-2 in this case and also here we had a little bit of bad luck because we score after the score and after we score the second goal. So we was almost there to win the match, it's true that in minute 84, two minutes after we score uh, Chelsea was scoring the goal, so 2-2, we got at least one point, that is the thing that we want and if we commit the match, of course much better, but in this case you can see that was a really competitive game, 7 shots, the opponent only 7 as well and the position almost the same, so really good result against Chelsea to get at least one point amazing against Everton guys that it's a really good team of course it's much better team at the start of the season than for example Norwich because Norwich I told you that it's the last objective you can see two new and uh, eight shots fantastic against Leicester City similar to Everton to say like that one new we don't your job uh, one score Buki seven shots the opponent only five that's it is the thing that we want against Liverpool guys one of the most important matches because Liverpool is on the top and we are down we are on the ground so you can see two new against Liverpool fantastic match uh, we scored two goals and you can see also guys uh, 10 shots and the opponent only two so that's fantastic the tactic is doing his job against Manchester City guys you can see two new similar game like for example Liverpool one you can see Puki was scoring Irons was scoring that's fantastic Puki man of the match Puki will be man of the match all the time or your striker will be man of the match a lot of times because he will score the goals you can see 10 shots the opponent only two and yes guys we are talking about Manchester City fantastic against Manchester United guys again two new Puki the man of the match two goals fantastic and also I think yeah 11 shots and the opponent only one the opponent only one and yes we are talking about Cristiano Ronaldo Sancho uh, Rashford players that they are really top in online soccer manager and this Manchester United it's a great team but you can see Chuni against West Ham that of course it's a really good opponent it's much better than us they have more quality players than us four new in this case you can see that sometimes you will not win only one new two new sometimes you can win like that four new so yes you can see four new uh, Puki was scoring a game Puki I think is scoring in all the games and you can see the man of the match against Puki fantastic 10 shots and the opponent only two now I will explain you what's going on when you use this tactic against one opponent similar to us or uh, lower than us. For example, Barley. Barley is similar to us, has the same team like us, uh, the same squad value, also is the computer. You see, use this tactic and it's not any sense to use this tactic, for example, against one lowest opponent or similar opponent or even if it's a little bit uh, much higher, more difficult but we have more chances to win him it's no sense to use for example 631 or one defensive tactic so in this case you can see 0-0 zero, zero, but uh, it's not any sense to use this tactic against this kind of opponents against Chelsea, Liverpool, the best teams yes it's fine but against the lowest opponent of course avoid it And that's everything for today guys hope that you like this video of course don't forget to support the channel with your big like to subscribe and also to comment what do you think about this tactic ciao